three families were first out when, their, when fire quickly spread to a group of homes in Gloucester. At least one of those homes looks to be a total loss. WBZ's Jim Smith is live on the scene in Gloucester tonight. Jim. Katie, still an active scene on Centennial Ave here in Gloucester. In fact, let me get out of the way so you can take a look. Firefighters all these hours later still here at the scene. This fire really moved quickly, and if it took off, half the neighborhood could have gone up in flames. Fortunately, that did not happen, but these homes here were hit hard. Gloucester firefighters working into Saturday night, trying to secure a home badly damaged by an afternoon blaze that swept through this coastal neighborhood. People living in the house where the fire is believed to have started were out getting ice cream when the flames broke out. The homeowners were not home. Uh, the neighbor saw the fire uh, in the lower level, in the garden level of, uh, of the house next door. He lived at uh, 74. He alerted the residents that were home in his residence, uh, as, the west, as the rest of the neighborhood, uh, to evacuate. Nobody was hurt in the fire, and the early indications are it was accidental, possibly starting in a storage area. But the state fire marshal's office is investigating. These houses on Centennial Ave are very tightly packed together, and firefighters are being credited with preventing an even larger blaze. These houses are closely spaced together. We had a little bit of wind today. Uh, this could have been a much different situation if we didn't have the professional response that we had, certainly from our Gloucester Fire Department, but also from neighboring communities, a great number of which responded and responded quickly to contain this fire scene to the two houses that we're looking at. And fortunately, luckily, once again, no injuries. The state fire marshal's office looking into the exact cause. Live in Gloucester tonight, Jim Smith, WBZ News.